Our next guest is an activist, author, producer, and Academy Award-winning actress who's joining us. This is very exciting for the third time, so that means we can officially call her a friend of the show. And today, she is here to tell us all about her new film, Coda, on Apple TV+. Take a look. My stuff's important, too. Please welcome Marley Matlin and her sign language interpreter and producing partner, Jack Jason. Welcome back to the show, Marley. It's so good to see you again. Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> Beautiful ladies, both of you. You oh. make my day every time I see you. Every time I see you, you make my day. Oh, we feel the very same about you. We were just talking about you. I'm sure your ears were burning during the commercial break, Marley. So we learned a, a fun fact about you recently that a very well-known actor actually discovered you at a young age. Can you tell us the story quickly? So that would be Henry, the one and only Henry Winkler. <laughs> Henry Winkler. Wow. And what he happened? He discovered me. We met we, well, we met when I was 20, 12 years old. I was doing a performance at the Center on Deafness uh, run by Dr. Pat Scherer outside of Chicago. And I knew he was coming, so I had a plan in mind to go up to him, say hi, and introduce myself. I did. I said I wanted to be an actor in Hollywood just like him on TV the same way in movies. And he said, sure, why not? Don't let anyone ever tell you otherwise. Don't let anyone tell you no. And I listened to him. And... Look where I am today. <laughs> I mean, that's not a bad actor to have helping you out, Marley. But um, I want to talk about CODA, which stands for Children of Deaf Adults. It is killing it, um, getting critical acclaim for Sundance Awards, 96% on Rotten Tomatoes. Um, it's such an incredible story. Tell us a little more about it. It's so uplifting, and the spirit and message in it is just really impactful. So it's, thank you so, for, so much for saying that. It's about uh, a family of four, three who are deaf and uh, one hearing daughter. And they live in a small fishing town and they make a living fishing on the ocean every day. And they're a very hardworking blue collar family. And it just so happens that one day you'll see the journey of each character as the daughter realizes that she has a talent in music that she wants to pursue. And for us to sort of be thrown off base because she wants to be involved in music. And that's what the movie's about. And I know that, Marley, you played a crucial role in making sure that the actor who played your husband in this film was a deaf actor. Tell us about that. Well, I, when, I was, when it came to casting, uh, when I first read the script, I said, oh, this is something I have to do. I really want to be in it. And then I saw that there was an actor who would be playing my husband. Um, the character and I said, you know what? Immediately, it was it had to be Troy Kotzer. It would be perfect to play the role to play Frank. And I knew that the director, Sean Hader, thought the same way. She agreed. She already had it in the back of her mind. And I made sure. But then when I heard that there was some hesitation, they wanted a box office star. They wanted a name to somebody who's hearing to play deaf. I said no, no. Um, acting deaf, uh, playing a deaf person is no longer a costume that a hearing person can put on and play. So I said, if you do it that way, I'm out. And of course, it didn't happen that way. No, you got it. I get it, you... though. I understand. I, I understand the importance of casting. But in this particular film, it was not right. You couldn't do it that. So uh, if you did it, I wouldn't be in it. Wow. You continue to inspire in new ways each time and again. Marley Matlin, Jack Jason, thank you both for being with us. We really appreciate it. We love when you're on the show. Please come back for a fourth, a fifth, a sixth time. <laughs> Coda is out in theaters now and streaming on Apple TV+. Plus. Oh, what a joy. Oh, gosh. I just I adore both of them. Wow. They're Fine. Amazing. Yeah, I, they, really. And, and I have chills listening to her Same. talk about just taking her stand. Yeah. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching.
and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.